Finally, we want to give our users option to store videos they want to watch later. To do that, we are going to use the cookies function from Next.js. Currently, the cookies function is read-only, but Next.js is looking to add write capability. That means that now we either have to manually set a cookie, which can be cumbersome, or use a third-party library. So let's create a watch later button, which is going to set watch later cookie for a given video. Our button needs to be a client component, as we are going to use browser-specific APIs like event handlers. Next, we're going to define the component. We're going to get video ID in the props, and we're going to define the HTML and CSS for the component. Next up, we want to define our event handler. And in this event handler, we're going to prevent the default event. And then we're going to define the cookie. And as I said, we need to do this manually. So we set the watch later cookie to true with the video ID. We're going to set a cookie path, the expiration date for one year. And we're going to set document cookie to the cookie we just created. Finally, we need to import use router from next navigation, use the use router hook, and we are going to call router.refresh, which is going to rerun the entire page on the server with the cookie that we just created. Then in the main videos page, we are going to import the cookies function from next headers. We're going to import the watch later button we just created. And then we're going to set the next cookies variable to cookies. And if the watch later cookie exists for this video ID, we want to return a string saying add it to watch later because this video has been already added to the watch later list. And if it hasn't been added yet, we are going to display the watch later button instead. If I now visit the videos page, you can see all the watch later buttons. And as soon as I'm going to click one of them, it's going to tell me that I added a video to the watch later list. If I refresh the page, it's still going to be in the watch later list because this information is stored in the browser cookie.